I told Peter Seidler and I, I told Ron Fowler, I said, if you build a winner, you'll draw $3 million. It's a baseball community. If you win, you will get every fan who wants to be part of the experience down to the gas lamp quarter. And you'll still get the Met and the Yankee and Dodger fans and the Giant fans and all those people who come more in their colors. This is such a unique, different market. There's nobody to compete with. San Diego State missed the opportunity uh, to, to grab Charger fan and make a Mastic fan. Totally blew it. That's why Snapdragon Stadium was half empty virtually all last season. So Seidler's got this blueprint of invest, win, enormous revenue streams by virtue of our past corporate sponsors, the Charger corporate sponsors, tremendous revenue stream as it relates to the fans, 3 million fans per game, including all those out-of-town fans wearing the Red Sox logo. He's He's got a, a, a blueprint here, and they continue to win and build. They're going to be able to continue to do this kind of $254 million a year business. It's a unique blueprint. Maybe you, maybe you can't put it into gear in Detroit, you know, because they got the Pistons and the Red Wings and the Detroit Lions and Michigan football. But in San Diego, they are the only show in town. So I think that's why they created this. It, now, it takes takes brass to do what he did, to invest all of his wealth, push it to the middle of the table. But you can see, if you connect the dots, all the business dots here, how this could work if you continue to win. So that's the blueprint that I think is out there. They own this market financially. They obviously own this market emotionally right now.